So I want to ask you a question about cholesterol because I just got my blood tests done and I had high cholesterol, but I had very low triglycerides, I believe yeah. it's called. Yeah, blood my fat. My dad also got the same thing done and we're both on the carnivore diet. My okay. dad just lost 25 pounds. I'm He's lifting fan. four or five days a week, walking 45 minutes a day. Best shape of his life. He's 57. Yep. He feels like he's 47. Why is the doctor telling him now that he needs a statin, oh. that he is about to have a heart attack and drop dead any second? Cholesterol is probably the most maligned and misunderstood compound in the entire human body. Wow. So first of all, if we talk about what cholesterol is and what it's not, yep. cholesterol is not a fuel source. So the body can't use cholesterol for energy. Okay. So then what is it? It's a construction material. Yeah. We use it to build every cell wall. We use it to build every cell membrane. Um, we use it to build every hormone in the human body. We actually use it to make something called vitamin D3, cholecalciferol. Mm. That is the most important nutrient in the human body, yep. bar none. If you said, what is the single most important nutrient in the human body? By far, vitamin D3. Wow. So vitamin D3 is the only vitamin that a human being can make on our own. Yep. There's hundreds of vitamins in your bloodstream right now. You're only capable of making one. So think about how important that must be yeah. to, to our optimal health. If it's the only vitamin human beings make. Yeah. So we make that from cholesterol. So the second thing about cholesterol is it's not really the amount of LDL cholesterol in your blood that matters. What matters is the size of that molecule, mm. right? So the smaller cholesterol gets, the more dangerous it becomes. Okay. The larger it gets, the healthier and less dangerous it becomes. Got it. So what determines the size? Triglyceride. Okay. Right? So as your blood fat goes up, your cholesterol gets smaller and more dangerous. Mm. As your blood fat goes down, cholesterol gets larger, and less dangerous. Wow. So it's actually very beneficial. In fact, if you look at the statin studies, yeah. you'll find that if you just focus narrowly on cardiovascular disease, you're, you're missing the point. Yeah. Because when you take statin, you increase all-cause mortality. So when people took heavy statin therapy, we would shorten their lifespan. So the thing that's supposed to be the cure is actually the thing that's killing yeah. them. I mean, think about this. You know, there's there are fatty acids. If something is necessary for life, we call it essential. There are three fatty acids that are essential. If you don't get these three fatty acids, you'll die. There are nine essential amino acids. If you don't get these nine amino acids, you'll die. There is no such thing as an essential carbohydrate. Just marinate on so that. You don't for a need carbohydrates. You do not need carbohydrates. To